What's up, everybody? Welcome back. <laughs> what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the. <laughs> hey, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. And today I'm going to show you how to change the color of any object in Affinity Photo. Are you ready? I definitely am. Let's jump straight into it. All right. So in order to change the color of this car, the first thing that you want to do is make an accurate selection of the object or this car in this case that you want to change color of. Now, there are multiple ways to do this. Um, you can either do this by using the quick selection brush. So I press W on the keyboard, um, change the brush size accordingly using the bracket keys and just brush over the parts of the subject or object that you want to change color of. Now, of course, I don't want to select all these black parts. So if I want to um, subtract from certain areas, all I would have to do is hold Alt or Option on a Mac and just brush over the parts that you want to deselect. And as you can see, Affinity Photo will deselect these parts. So by holding Alt, you will deselect and by holding nothing, let's say you will add to your selection. This is one way to do it. Another more accurate way is by using the pen tool. So the pen tool you can select by pressing P on the keyboard. Just zoom in a little bit and just trace your object. Um, this is not going to be a tutorial on how to use the pen tool. So if you don't know how to use the pen tool, just use the quick selection brush. Um, one quick tip if you use the pen tool. So let me make a very rough selection actually. So um, I'm just going to do this very, very sloppy and very ugly. But I just want to show you a very cool thing about the pen tool. So let's say I'm going to use this as my mask. So I'm going to click mask. Now, what I want to do now is I want to subtract this part from my mask. So how am I going to do this? Um, I can use the pen tool for this as well. So if I want to deselect this part or let's say mask out this part of my selection, yeah, just trace around and of course way more accurate than I'm doing right now. What you want to do is click on selection and then click on your Lambo layer, which in this case is orange Lambo layer, and then hit the mask icon. Now, invert your mask, so click on the mask and press Command I, and now you can see that we have actually distracted this part from our pen tool curve selection. Now, of course, do not waste your time. I have already made my selection, so I'm gonna delete this curve selection for now because I'm not gonna need it. I'm gonna go into my channels, and here I find my saved selection, so I've called it Lambo selection, so I'm gonna right click on that and load to pixel selection, and there I have my selection of my Lamborghini. Now, to change color, go to your adjustment layers and click on recolor. And because we have our selection loaded, what will happen is our uh, recolor adjustment layer will have this selection applied as a mask. So as you can see, we have got this mask applied to our recolor adjustment layer. So if I want to change color, all I would have to do is drag the U around. So let's go right over here. Of course, I can turn, uh, turn it into any color, but let's go for some nice uh, bright orange. Um, you can change the saturation as well. You can change the lightness as well and that is how you change the color of any kind of object like and subscribe for more affinity photo tutorials see you in the next one ciao ciao